AlphaDev by Google DeepMind is a beautiful example how fundamental research in AI will result in a better world. It all started with the development of AlphaZero that made the news few years ago by being able to beat the best chess engines and then the world champion in Go. The reason why so many researchers focus on games is because games have a very clearly stated rules. But in the last year, DeepMind took AlphaZero from games to tackling real world problems. And the way they did this was to take real world problems and turn it into games for AlphaZero to play. A few months ago, I made a video how AlphaTensor, a modification of AlphaZero, was able to find better matrix multiplication algorithms. And now AlphaDev optimized algorithms for sorting. Computers have to do sorting all the time, up to trillions of times every single day. Every time you log into Netflix, your movies are sorted according to some specified criteria. So let's just jump in super quick into the paper to see what they did. One of the fundamental questions in computer science science is how to sort a sequence. Decades of computer science research have focused on discovering and optimizing sorting algorithms. In this work, we focus on two types of small sort algorithms. First, the fixed sort, and second, the variable sort. So fixed sort is a fixed sequence length. So let's say you're trying to sort a sequence of three uh, values. And variable sort is when the length of the sequence can vary. So it can be anywhere from one to let's say five different values. We formulate the problem of discovering new efficient sorting algorithms as a single player game that we refer to as assembly game. The hardness of the assembly game arises not only from the size of the search space, but also from the nature of the reward function. To play the game, we introduce AlphaDev, a learning agent that is trained to search for correct and efficient algorithms. This agent is made out of two core components, first, a learning algorithm, and second, a representation function. The learning algorithm is essentially the extension of AlphaZero, and the representation function is interchangeable and captures the underlying structure of assembly programs. The primary AlphaDev representation is based on transformers. And here are the results. Using AlphaDev, we have discovered fixed and variable sort algorithms from scratch that are both new and more efficient than the state-of-the-art human benchmarks. So this is pretty much the meat of the paper. This is what they found. Uh, I think it's actually more interesting uh, how they found it, uh, the actually alpha dev uh, development and uh, the underlying structure behind it than the actual results of the algorithms. But the algorithms will push the human know-how further and be able to optimize pretty much any uh, computation function. Here are the results in table one. Uh, here in this column, we have the alpha dev uh, results. Uh, so the shorter the better and here is the human benchmark so you can see that for all sequence lengths the alpha dev algorithms is either the same length or shorter than the human benchmark algorithm the paper overall is pretty technical so i won't go into the details because i'll lose most of the viewers if you uh, are really familiar with this topic i highly suggest you go read the paper in its entirety it's really fascinating and for my general audience i want to highlight that there's a lot of research happening in ai outside of chat gpt gpt4 and all these different large language models that are catching all the headlines this type of artificial intelligence is not as uh flashy and sexy as uh, the large language models, but this will really result in fundamental breakthroughs. And if you think about it, these uh, sorting algorithms are used so many times uh, in all different computer programs. So every little tiny little optimization will help with uh, energy consumption and speed. If you found this content useful, please consider subscribing to this channel. I have a lot more really interesting AI topics to cover. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next video.